Let's simplify the fraction 15 over 18. So what we're trying to do is find another fraction here for 15 eighteenths that has the same value. It's an equivalent fraction, but it's in lowest terms. What we need to do is find a common denominator. Let's just list the multiples here for 15 and 18. So for 15, 1 times 15, 3 times 5, that's pretty much it. 18, we'd have 1 times 18. 2 times 9, 3 times 6, that's pretty much it. So as we look for the greatest common factor, and we see here in the numerator that's 3, and in the denominator, that's 3. So we're going to divide each of these by 3. Let's move this. So 15 divided by 3, that's 5. 18 divided by 3, that's 6. So we can simplify the fraction 15 eighteenths down to 5 6. And this is an equivalent fraction. If you divided 15 by 18, you'd get the same number as if you divided 5 by 6. We've just reduced 15 eighteenths down to 5 6. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.